firstly, it's so wonderful to be back in Korea. I've spent about eight months of my life performing here, last time in Seoul and Daegu. The people are so beautiful and the cuisine is absolutely divine. I've been eating bibimbap and uh, gimbak all week, which has been good. As for the Korean audiences, uh, their passion and enthusiasm for musical theatre is unmatched to anywhere that I've performed in around the world. Um, they know how to do musical theatre so well, they're an educated audience. You really have to be on your toes. I was in the front row, my friend gave me her ticket and I turned to my, my friend's mum and I said, I have to do the show one day. And what I meant by that was, I have to be the Phantom one day. And that was 2004, seven years later I was but I'm so glad I was. So I think there's a lot of reasons, but um, the, I think the main reason is that it's it's a universe. There's so many universal themes that are prevalent in Phantom of the Opera. There's um, there's love. There's um, there's loss. There's jealousy, and we can all relate to one or more of the characters in Phantom of the Opera. And um, the music is it's transcending. It's um, there's there's just so many reasons that Phantom has been around for over 30 years. Just happy to be part of it. The Phantom was abandoned by his mother from birth uh, because of the way he looked. Now, I wasn't necessarily abandoned by my mother at birth, but my mother died when I was very young, comparatively. Um, so I know what it's like to go through life without that leadership that you need. Um, and in a very strange way, the show helps me reclaim a relationship with my mother because I feel her every performance, certainly. Um, so it's, it's a gift in that sense for me. The, the, the show's quite therapeutic for me to do and it's, it's why I'm happy to do this, you know, indefinitely. As for the role of Christine, it is a really special one for me. It's a role that I grew up uh, listening to and um, it's a really unique role as well because you have to sing operatically and also be able to dance um, cl classical ballet, which are two things that I have been trained in, luckily, um, since a very early age. So. Um, it kind of is my dream role and my perfect role and I'm just so thankful to be able to do it again. Um, I've spent a lot of my career so far um, playing playing some younger roles and so I think Raoul is a nice um, role to graduate from the more of like the simpler young, like a teenager's early 20s where it's um, they're finding love for the first time. I think with Raoul, the way I play him, he's truly falling in love for the first time. But there have been other women in his life before, but I think when he meets Christine and re-meets Christine, he realizes that love can be so much deeper. And so I think that attracts me to this role. I get to be, I feel a little more grown up. I get to, you get to deal with some themes and uh, that are a little more complex. So it's really nice to have a character arc to, to go from, you start in one place in the beginning and then end in another place, um, just a little bit more fully formed as a human being. So um, it's a treat to get to, to do that. So, um, yeah. <laughs> I think the fact that the Phantom is, he's a dangerous man, but he's not evil in, in the true sense. The kind of Phantom I would want to bring to Korean audiences, aside from being my version, is certainly a more fragile, uh, childlike uh, Phantom not just screaming and shouting, not that previous phantoms are just screaming and shouting, but I think people expect him to just be this monster all the time. Uh, with seven years more life experience under my belt and hopefully bring more depth to Christine uh, than seven years ago.